How's it going everybody? Zoinkmeister Patrick here with a big, big update for anyone who's interested in playing Unity web browser games. As of the year 2020, the Unity web page no longer allows the Unity web browser plugin to be downloaded. So while that is unfortunate news for anyone who's interested in getting into these games, uh, I do have a couple possible solutions, I think. So I'll go over them now. There's there's two that I have in mind. Uh, but if you can think of anything else, please leave a comment down below. And uh, if you've seen this video and you are interested in these Unity web browser games at all, and you want to help support this community of people who are interested in this, please, please leave a like on this video as interaction helps YouTube know that people are interested in this content and uh, it allows more people to see it. So if you are interested in seeing this, it probably means someone else is. And so it would help everyone. It would help people like you watching this video a lot if you like this video. So hit that like button, please. And let me get on to the first of these two solutions that I know about. So first of all, let me prove real quick that I don't think this still works. So this is my um, video that I made recently and uh, about the Unity web players. This was um, back in September. <laughs> but uh, unfortunately, if you look down here in the download leaks, I put this Unity web player, but I crossed it out because it no longer works. And to show this, here it is. I tapped it out for us ahead of time. If I go into this um, web page, you'll see I just go to unity.com and there is no download here for the web player. They uh, revised their website recently and the link no longer works and no longer takes you to that download. So how can we fix this, right? This is the important part. Well, I have two potential options. The first option is to use this program, Game Load. And I will admit that I don't know if this option works 100%. I've never had it confirmed for me, unfortunately. But um, you'll see here that if I open up game load, you go into menu, help, download, and then Unity, and you hopefully can download the Unity from here. There's also Flash and Shockwave, but I've never tried clicking this button, and I don't know if it personally uh, will work or not. So if you can try this and leave a comment letting me know if it worked or not, I will add that to the description of this video. So if you're coming here in the future, go ahead and check the description. I will leave that information there once I figure it out for sure. And I will probably also have a table of contents down there if you want to skip around and figure things out, maybe for coming back to the video or if you know exactly what you're looking for. So to real quick prove that this, um, the Unity web player that I currently have on my PC still works, I'm going to go ahead and go to the Attack on Titan tribute game by Feng Li, which is a game that was popular on this channel a little while ago. And you can see here that the game still plays just fine. Um, I can go in and the game totally works, right? Boop, boop, doo. Uh, it's good stuff. So um, this Unity web player uh, game load works for me with this game. I want to point out though, that for some people I've heard uh, are having trouble with their specific game. I want you to know that for a couple years now, the Unity web player has no longer been available to use in any major web browser, which means that a lot of websites might be taking down their games that use the Unity engine because uh, they're taking up space and people can't actually play those games unless they do things like this. So if you're interested in game load, you wanna know how to download it, um, you can go back to that video that I showed you earlier in this video. I will leave a link in the description as well as put a card up in the top corner of the video. But you have to make sure you have annotations on in order to see those. Uh, so that'll be available to you. That's option number one. If it works, uh, like I said, I have not been able to confirm it because I have my own copy of Unity Web Player and I don't wanna mess with that because we currently cannot get another one. So that takes me to the second option, which is of course the Unity web player that I currently own. If there's a way for me to get this out there, I might be interested in doing something like this if you guys are. If you're interested in my copy of Unity web player and you think downloading that, if I can like maybe put it in a Dropbox or something, I'm really not sure what the best way of going about that is, but uh, you have the option. So if you do want this, please, subscribe to the channel and leave a comment telling me that you're interested in this because with enough support I can I can I can figure this out but I don't want to put it out there in case you know if no one wants this if no one cares then I, you know why do it right I don't, I don't want to try to figure out what the heck is going on with all that um, unless I know people are interested so if you are then uh, yes I highly recommend subscribing because otherwise you might have a difficult time finding our channel again we are a growing channel that can be you know hard to find for people sometimes so I do recommend 
doing that and subscribing because that allows YouTube to uh, bring you back to this channel again in an easier way and even allow you to find it for yourself a lot easier just by checking your subscription list and stuff like that. So I highly recommend that option. The next thing that I want to talk about is for people who are specifically interested in playing the Attack on Titan tribute game by Feng Li. If you are one of those people, I do have alternate options for you, but I will go ahead and move those to another video. I don't want to make those a part of this video because this video is for the Unity web player community and anyone interested in playing Unity browser games. So like I said earlier in the video, if you want to support this community of people like you watching this and want to know about this, please like, you know, commenting, subscribing, all that, any interaction with the video in any way in the channel allows YouTube to push this further, whatever, and help other people, you know, know about it. So I just want to get that out there and let people know. So like I said, if you're interested in seeing those alternate ways of playing the Attack on Titan tribute game in case none of these other methods work out, what you can do is subscribe and hit the notification bell and you will see when that video goes up because it should be coming up soon. Don't worry. Uh, I do plan on making this video shortly. So if you are on the notification list, <laughs> then you should get it in your subscription feed uh, in the near future, showing you um, the alternate methods that I know to play the Attack on Titan tribute game by Fangly if all of this uh, Unity web player stuff ends up not working. So. Thank you so much for watching the video. Thank you for your interactions with the video as it'll help people like you to see it. And hopefully I'll see you soon. But this is the time where I of course let you know that this channel is dedicated to other things and gaming as a whole. So if you're interested in watching a fun two dudes play some games and please check out the other videos on this channel as we are a fun group of guys and let us know in the comments where you found us and <laughs> that you, uh, you enjoy what we do. So thank you so much, and I'll hopefully see you around. Soink out.